this is the very short tutorial for those who still don't know what is the easiest solution to install GDAL CLI. In order to do that, first of all, you need to go to osgeo.com slash project slash osgeo4w. Uh, if you, I'll put this link in the description, video description as well. And then second step is to download the software. So osgeo4w. So simply, uh, download this osgeo4w installer software and then uh, click here to start installing this software and then you need to click uh, run and then express installer and then download and then whatever software you want to download for me i'm particularly interested in zidal so i click zidal and then click next and simply it will take some time depending on your internet uh, speed and after that I'll show you how to run it properly. All right, installation is complete. So I can now check the, this PC, C drive and then OSGO4W and here is my GDAL files. So if you want to run the GDAL, so still if you type GDAL, info in the command line so it says that it's not found right the next step is to simply add this path to our uh, system environment so in order to do that simply show more properties and then and then advanced system setting environment variable and then in the path simply add your path c with zero and bin that's all and simply click ok ok and then now uh, again open the command front and then type gdal info and then this time you'll see the error because we did not provide any data set but it's correctly uh, installed and now you can use all the gdal command line uh, in order to run your program still the thing is like if you type python and then from osgeo import gdal the gdal is still not imported i mean uh, in not installed that means we just install the gdal cli not the uh, python gdal and if you are interested to install python gdal then watch the video uh, up here or in the description below for python installation the easiest solution is to go with conda installation thanks for watching see you in next tutorial